Thank you for taking the time to check out practical scales and arpeggios for violin. As a musician, you have to learn scales. They're the foundation of what it means to learn to play a musical instrument. However, most scale books out there are not user friendly. They pack way too much information and too little a space, making it difficult to read, as well as no space to write lesson notes or comments during practice. They also make it quite difficult to find the scales you need by not having a table of contents. And their designs and covers are usually pretty boring as well. I wanted to create a book for my students that was better. It starts with a beautiful design that makes you want to pick up the book and actually open it. It also gives you the very foundation of what you need without being too big, so it's not as bulky to carry around. When you open this book, you have a table of contents that make it easy to find the scales that you need. The preface of this book describes what makes a good scale system. What a scale is actually describes what makes a major scale, what makes a minor scale, and what a scale actually is. The teacher or the student can utilize the maps in this book to help visualize where things are on the instrument. How to practice scales effectively and efficiently describes some of the really good practices that you can follow as a musician. What should you practice? How to practice? That's all described in this section. This book can be used by itself or as part of a series in a string orchestra ensemble. Page 16 has C major scales arpeggios for every instrument, whether you play violin, viola, cello, or bass, page 16 will have C major. Page 17 will have the relative minor with the same key signature and page 17. I hope you found this video helpful. Discover how practical scales and arpeggios can empower you to play better, learn faster, and score higher. Thank you.